It is now official. North Korean leader Kim Jong-un's younger sister will be flying to Seoul using a private jet for a three-day visit. Jim Young-gil delves deeper into the significance of the first visit to South Korea by a member of the regime's Kim dynasty. Kim Yo-jong, the younger sister of North Korean leader Kim Jong-un, is expected to arrive in South Korea on Friday afternoon. She will be the first member of the North ruling Kim family to ever set foot on South Korean soil. The prominent figure is scheduled to arrive at Incheon International Airport at 1.30 p.m. on a private jet flying directly from Pyongyang. Kim Jong-un's influential sister will be accompanied by three other top officials, and the plane is expected to return to Pyongyang as soon as the passengers disembark. The jet will come back on the evening of February 11th to take the high-level delegation back home. Kim Yo-jong is expected to head to Pyeongchang to attend the opening ceremony of the Winter Olympics. The 30-year-old Kim, who has seen her profile rise steadily since 2014, was promoted to North Korea's Politburo last year. However, according to North Korea experts, Kim Yo-jong's sudden inclusion in the North Korean high-level delegation may have irritated the United States, which has sent its own delegation led by Vice President Mike Pence to counter North Korea's charm offensive. Last year, the U.S. Treasury Department included Kim Yo-jong on its list of blacklisted officials. Seoul's Unification Ministry says it believes that Kim Yo-jong's visit is a reflection of the regime's willingness to ease tensions on the Korean Peninsula, along with a message of celebration for the Pyeongchang Winter Olympics. Kim Young-gil, Arirang News.